Hello my lingerie addicts. More fun lingerie try-ins for you guys. This one's just a short quickie for you, but you know, sometimes quickies are fun. <laughs> of course, I have a fun little lingerie outfit to share with you. So, what do I have for you guys today? This lingerie outfit comes from westbeaver.com. That is my own personal lingerie website. It is by Cheryl of Hollywood. I don't know if you can see this. It is the Lace Teddy Two-Toned Stretch. It is definitely different than the picture, I've got to say. Because the picture shows this lovely black strap that's going across the middle of my chest as being here, below your chest, kind of supporting your girls. Now, I tend to be a little busty, so it does make sense that it would sit a little higher on me. However, this is sitting quite high. It seems a little bit... Not quite matching the picture, since the picture did show it under the breasts. So, um, it's going to get a little bit of a fail on the fit. Other than that, though, I feel like it fits really nice. The lace is soft and a little bit stretchy. I love that the black bottom is high-waisted. It is a little bit sheer, as you can tell. So I did enlist the help of a flesh tone bra and panties to make this more YouTube appropriate. Yes, I know that might be frustrating and seem weird, but we want to have some fun with our lingerie trans here. We don't want YouTube to get mad at us. So if you do want to see them sans the excesses, you know where to go. On my Patreon, anytime you are wanting, which will be linked at the end of the video, or I also share them on my OF, my OnlyFans. Now, it is a thong, so I can't show you the full back. It is a high-waisted thong, and I do feel like it fits really well as far as length and it's not bunching or binding or pulling at the middle which is important because sometimes teddies are too short or too long and when they're too short they bind at the crotch which is really uncomfortable so overall i find this quite comfortable the black strap actually sits quite nicely over my nipples which i think is actually kind of fun because it gives you more of a peekaboo of your bottom cleavage while giving a little bit more uh, upper coverage, so you can't quite see the nipples, which is fun. So as much as this didn't live up to the picture, I still enjoyed it. I still think it's a fun little number. The bottoms are stretchy, so you could move them side to side if you wanted to leave this on during play. The back has the crisscross up top with adjustable straps. I have loosened this as wide as it goes, and that's as wide as it goes. <laughs> I do find it's a little difficult to get on and off, so keep that in mind, ladies. Maybe this is something you wear to show off and then change before other things happen. I found it a little awkward getting out of it, so maybe not the most graceful. <laughs> but the lace has a really nice kind of white, shiny additive to it, just along the edging to uh, highlight the material, the pattern of the lace, which is fun and I thought was very playful. This is, of course, from westreader.com, and I will link that in the comments below. But just for you, something different black. Yes, oh, I almost forgot. The stockings. My favorite stockings, which I also get from westreader.com, are Elegant Moments. They are my favorite because they're very durable. I like that they're a thicker, soft material with a thick band. But the band doesn't contain any elastic or any stay-up. But I prefer that personally because I don't like when they're too elastic-y or have too much of a pull-up stay up on top because then they cut in and they make me feel uncomfortable for those of us with slightly bigger thighs, more curvy with more in this general area. I like when they're stretchy but comfortable. I'd rather have to tug them up on occasion than feel that they're cutting in and making me feel uncomfortable. These are my favorite because I find they're durable, they last a long time, they last several wears, they're easy to throw in the wash and hang dry, and then they get a little tighter again for you, which is perfect. They come in a range of colors, black, white, red, pink, blue, purple, different blue, <laughs> uh, light pink, I've gotten all the above, orange. <laughs> I like when things are durable and come in many colors, so those are my favorite stockings. I'll also link those below. All the stockings you pretty much see me wear are exclusively elegant moments just because those are my favorite and I know that they're gonna fit and I know I'm gonna feel confident and comfortable in them because after all for the ladies watching or the guys wanting to get something for your girl 
I feel the number one important thing when picking lingerie is to feel comfortable. Because when you feel comfortable in your outfit, you're going to feel confident and that confidence is going to radiate out of you and it's a very beautiful thing that I feel any girl wearing lingerie should feel comfortable and confident in what she's wearing because it's supposed to make you feel pretty and accentuate, not make you feel a little bit like, ooh, I'm going to cover up. So there you guys have just a fun little outfit I wanted to share. Not quite what I expected, but I rolled with it and it was still fun. I hope you guys have a wonderful day and don't forget to click that subscribe button because, you know, more lingerie is on the way. Bye for now.